Hello, uh, Sam here again from StudentMit and I just want to talk to you today about student content insurance and why I think it's valuable to have. Um, so for instance, if you live in student accommodation, which is the big blocks and uh, there are a lot of you in or in there, it's quite secure. You know, you have a key fob to get into the first door and you probably have a key fob to get into the second door into the communal bit and then you'll have your uh, room key or door key. It's staffed pretty much most uh, most of the day and it has a lot of security around it. Doesn't mean it won't be targeted, but there are a lot of factors which will put people off doing anything or burglars going in there. However, if you live in a student house, so if you're in the community, um, you know, you're slightly set out in the city centre, I think it's really worth you getting uh, contents insurance. It doesn't have to be expensive, um, but the reason why I think this is because if you have a house and there's five students, that usually means there's five laptops, five TVs, five of every precious thing that you want. Um, you know, if you've got jewellery, it's five sets of jewellery, you know, all that kind of stuff. And um, they are targeted more than actual families because they know there's a high concentration of valuables in that area. You know, and they do go for that. So it's basically two birds, one stone. They have to put a lot of effort in and they can get a greater reward. Um, if you have insurance, it's basically a backup. I'm not saying you go all out on this, but it's something just to protect you to make sure that if you do lose it, you are you know you're going to be covered for it because as a student, money is always tight, and I know insurance is the last thing on your mind. However, if it's a hundred pound for the year, if you can you know make that hundred pound up somehow, and then it just protects you. If you don't need it, it's a win. But if you do need it, you can replace a lot of your content, and um, you know it can be a a uh, massive hassle going through the insurance process, but it can be worth it. However, just the last point, if you live in student accommodation, which is big blocks, um, you are likely to get content insurance uh, included in your rent, but I'd always check that first. Um, this is because um, the actual block will have insurance and in there they will add content insurance already, which will cover your items. It'll just be a blanket cover. So there'll be no, nothing special about it. It'll be cover your content and that's it. If you have any questions about it, as I say, head to the website student-it.com and uh, chat to me through WhatsApp or Messenger and I'll answer your questions.